Hi guys. Beautiful one there, sorting the chicks out. Oh yeah, finally, finally got the rest of these potatoes in. Yeah. We've got 76 bags and tubs in total. It's not as many as we wanted to do. We'd planned and aimed for about 100 bags and tubs in total. Um, but some of the, the seed potatoes that we got um, that was delivered were like um, small, a little bit smaller than uh, golf ball size. So, uh, <laughs> yeah, we had to use three, you know, two or three or four of them in some of these uh, 30 or 40 some uh, litre bags and tubs. Uh, Coloured tubs, uh, we've got from Aldi's 2 a tub. Um, we was kindly uh, bought those um, by a, f a friend of ours, so thank you to them. Uh, the bags we got off eBay. <coughs> Uh, those tubs we got off Amazon, we've had those a while um, and we've had some bags and bits and bobs from uh, previous year growing. So we finally got the potatoes in, uh, covering about eight or nine different varieties. Uh, a few, um, uh, Some of them are uh, unknown. Uh, we just bought us uh, salad potatoes and started chitting so uh, we thought we'd give those a go, see what comes of them. Rhubarb, everybody's showing video on the rhubarb um, We're going to take some of that uh, later today Or later on We've got uh, flowers starting to come on the gooseberries <coughs> These are going to really flower and do really well this year I think uh, Growers Doing really well Breeding pen uh, We're getting Usually three a day from from that breeding pen. Main pen over there doing really well. We just moved the gold Dutch bantams. As you can see, the polytunnel still isn't done. Um, we haven't been able to get any wood to do the uh, to do the framing out, and we're still waiting for the sheet to come anyway. Fruit trees and everything all doing well. We've got the shallots in finally. We've got some onions to go in there as well, and peas at that end. Um, this bed here, part of it will be brassicas and the other part will be uh, sweet corn um, and bits and bobs that we can't, that we haven't got uh, space for, uh, just chuck, chuck stuff in really. Uh, polytunnel, we had a big plan for that, mainly onions, tomatoes and bits of salad and, and stuff, um, but at the moment it's, uh, it's on hold. Junk pile really, um, apart from the pallets, just got to get those uh, deboarded and ready to use. Big pile of wood chip and the compost bins. As you can see, see how far it's dropped. Not a lot really. I was expecting it to drop a little bit more actually. Uh, now in here is a lot of the compost and stuff that we took out of uh, out of the chicken pen and uh, as you can see it's uh, composted down real well there's no smell or anything to it um, the only thing is this grass that we've got here was given by somebody um, it's got uh, little seeds growing in it. But what we're hoping is the uh, is the heat this summer will kill all that off. That's dropped a little bit, but not a lot. Uh, this one again is just up a little bit. Going to get some fungus and stuff in there now, so. That's uh, going to help start breaking that all down. That one is as yet to have anything put into it. 
Well, like I say that's all but just being dug out of the the main chicken pen over there, and then we shall be ready to put more of that wood chip in over there once it's uh, ready. We've got some uh, thistles and that to dig out of this uh, back to Eden bed. Um, that shouldn't be too bad, to be honest. Um, those will be moving this over this weekend and then we shall have a, a full run and we'll get this bed tidied up um, and what have you. But plan for this year is to section off beds, just define the areas a little bit to be more, more than anything, um, just so we know where we are. And we think we'll get about maybe three or four beds onto on here because this bed comes right up to here so one space two the space three this little space and then a little one on this end and same on that bed we're going to find beds on there as well um, but they're all going over to the no dig beds so uh, yeah there we go guys just a little bit of an update for you and uh, we'll finish on potatoes starting to come through there we go guys beautiful one is putting chicks out and uh, we'll catch you later cheers for now <laughs>